we're booksellers, we always like to check out interesting bookstores when we travel. This is The Strand, which is renowned for bookstores in New York. They claim, and it's probably true, that they have 18 miles of books. There are four floors of books, including an entire floor devoted to rare books and such. And it's just floor-to-ceiling books everywhere you look. It's very amazing. Make the journey to the village to come check it out. So another classic New York store, a little different from the Strand, is Forbidden Planet. This is probably one of the best uh, stores selling comic books, manga, and related stuff anywhere. Forbidden Planet you'll find, of course, whatever the latest comic books are, they're usually published weekly. I even found, harking back to my childhood, a Richie Rich comic book, which I liked. Um, they have comics for all ages. Uh, they have comic anthologies. Um, you'll also find some pretty rare, a lot of imported Japanese manga, um, little toys and games that go with that. There were all kinds of little imp toys imported from Japan. They had figurines of all kinds, um, again from the manga, lots of Star Wars stuff, they had even a lot of Disney stuff that you don't see everywhere, um, a lot of which again was imported from Japan. So it's a really cool place to go if you like that kind of thing, but want things that are a little out of the ordinary. It's great to go into a place where they have everything there for you to look at in person, and there's just something so much more satisfying about browsing in person and you know maybe you find the book you're looking for but then you see the one sitting next to it on the shelf and it's actually even better than what you had in mind and that's the joy of browsing in an actual store